you know, because I'm just feeling myself. I know you see the new, new. Mm -mm. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> okay. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Glam by Jen. If you are new, welcome. If you are not, welcome back. In today's video, it's very different from what I normally post. So if you do not like needles, please just exit out this video and watch my other videos. But for those of you who are staying, I just want to give a quick um, disclaimer on the video. The first couple of clips that I recorded, I thought I was going to put in a weekly vlog, but I ended up just wanting to put it in its own video. So if it looks a bit off, that is why. So I just want to let you guys know that way you can understand throughout the video what's going on. But yeah, for those of you that are staying, baby girl, I love my lips. You see this? Mm. You see that? You see it. I know. You see me. Let me know if you guys have any questions on the comments down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel because I do have some more new content dropping this week. I hope you guys enjoy this video. So yeah, these are my lips before. I don't have anything on them. No lip liner, anything at all. Just like um, some gloss. That's it. I think I can take off my mask now though. Should I take off my jacket? I think I should because I'm getting hot. Like, that's how nervous I am. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Hold this. All right, guys. I'm a little nervous, but, you know, I'm going to have my honey record since I'm just afraid that I might drop the camera or something. All right, guys. I am here with Erin. Hi, I'm Erin. I am the owner of Beauty Shot, located at 123 West Layton and Greenfield. Um, today we're going to be doing lip filler. I'm pretty excited. So actually once this gets on your lips, I would say like don't, if you can avoid talking, just because it gets on your tongue. So it's just not a lot of fun. And then as soon as um, we're done numbing here, we'll uh, rinse with Listerine and then we'll, we'll talk more about what you're looking to see different with your lips. Addicted. <laughs> uh oh. I'm gonna wipe this off. So you got your tongue at all? Mm -mm. Oh, that's good. I'm so numb. <laughs> <laughs> all right, exciting. If you need any breaks, you just let me know. Okay. Otherwise, I have um this vibrating gold bar, squeeze balls, like for distraction. Okay. Yeah, I'll take one. Here's a squeeze ball too, if you want it. And it'll get really hot and there's a fan. <laughs> oh, she is prepared. <laughs> I'm gonna alcohol off the lid. So Cupid's bow area tends to be like a spicier area. If you need any breaks, just let me know with a poke. I'm gonna lay some filler. How terrible is it? Mm -mm. And then just remember to breathe. So I just got back home and I'm going to just touch up my face a little bit because my tears were coming down when I was getting my lip fillers and it kind of messed up my makeup. So yeah, I'm just going to touch it up a little bit like on my under eyes. So yeah, this is what my lips look. Mind you, it's still a little swollen. Mm -mm. So they look pretty good, if you ask me. They do, they look pretty good. 
she really snapped on my bottom lip because I told her that I felt like my bottom lip was um smaller than my upper lip so I feel like she definitely did her thing with that I noticed that right away um she literally took her time was patient was over prepared what I mean by over prepared she had like a little vibrate thing I would put under my chin. She gave me a squeeze ball. She gave me a fan. And I literally figured out how to work everything at the same time. Because I was getting hot, nervous, anxiety, everything at the same time. But she was so patient. She was like, do you need a break? Do you want some water? Like, uh, she was just awesome. So if you're in the Milwaukee area and you're looking to get lip fillers or anything like that, go to Erin. I'm actually going to, let me grab my phone. I'll show you guys her Instagram. So this is her Instagram, um, and she does have a lot of pictures of her work. Um, she does quite a, a few other things, so you guys should check her out. She's awesome. It was so quick, too. It wasn't like it took a long time. It literally was like 10 minutes. It was just me being a big baby about it. I had to take a little water break, but it really didn't hurt that bad. Like, when I think about it, I'm like, it really didn't hurt that bad. I think my own, like, anxiety just got the best of me, and I was, like, all tensed up, but... In the middle of the process, I kind of was like, okay, let me take a breather. Like, let me calm down. And everything went just fine. So, um, I'll be going back in two weeks to get the rest of the syringe. Right now, she did tell me that my lips were a little swollen. So, this is not how full that they would normally be. So, it's going to go down in like two, three days, she said. Um, but yeah, I love it. It was so worth it. And like I said, the pain was tolerable. Okay, this is my lips today. So you can't really tell a major difference, but you can tell a little difference. My lips, they feel fine. They don't, they don't hurt or anything. I know you can see the little bruises, but they're doing okay for the most part. I feel like she definitely put more on this side because this side of my lip was lower than this side. So that's why you can see more bruising on that side. And then she went ham on my bottom lip because my bottom lip was never this big. It was always like smaller than my top lip. It would be like... I felt like that's how my pot was. I'm really here for it. I cannot wait to get um the other half of my syringe hey guys i am back so it has been two weeks since my last um lip appointment um and let me just recap i thought that i was gonna put my lip up lip appointment with the weekly vlog that i was doing but a lot ended up happening that week that i didn't have time to end up vlogging so i decided to just put my um lip injections as its own video so if that first clip looks a little funny it's because of that so yeah but today is my uh, appointment day i'm super excited for it because i do want my lips to look a little bit more full this is how they're looking now and they still look pretty natural like in person you really can't tell too much um my bottom lip definitely looks a, uh, like a major difference but the top lip looks pretty natural so you really can't tell that i got my lips done um so i'm really really excited to get that other half of the syringe in um because i definitely want to keep the natural look i don't want them to look too bubbly but i do want to have like a little more plump look so yeah i am headed there and i will see you guys when i get there Hey guys, so we just got here and um, she's currently with somebody so we're just in her waiting area um, which is okay because we got here a little bit earlier today so Don't lie. <laughs> I'm just late y'all we were late and it's okay because she's not even gonna notice that we're late because she's still with someone so <laughs> yeah, there you go. it's cool. Alright guys we just got here. Hi Erin! I'm a little nervous already when I sat down on the chair. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited though. Awesome. I like um, them. They look good. Yeah. I think they look really nice. Where do you want to see more? Okay. So I love what you did on the bottom lip. I okay. feel like immediately I seen a change with that and okay. I, I'm obsessed. So I want you to just kind of use your best judgment. I trust you. Thanks. And I just want them to just be a little more plump and full while okay. keeping the bottom lip as is okay like i love how like if i could just make them 
a little more full that's it like yeah. i feel like you got my shape right you did what i told you about the bottom lip yeah. like I, I they look real good okay perfect yeah let's just bring this up just a little bit more mm -hmm. um just to make it a little bit more symmetrical and then yeah everywhere else will just kind of fill up all right let's put some numbing cream on you nervous did it hurt last time Got that numbing cream on so she can't talk. <laughs> Is it very numb? Yeah. Alright, let's wipe this off then. Okay, and then if you want to rinse with a Listerine. Yeah, at least you know what to expect now, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> How do you feel? I feel good. Does it hurt? Um, I feel like I didn't feel nothing at all right here. Only like the top part I felt it. Okay. But in all honesty, I feel like definitely I was more numb this mm -hmm. time. It was hurt. I did just open up a new bottle of mm -hmm. um, numbing cream. So usually when they're like first open, it's extra potent. guys so i just got done getting my lips done for the second time they are really swollen so i won't be able to tell if i want to get another syringe or not until it goes down um but i basically told her that i wanted my the sides of my upper lips to be a little bit bigger and she executed exactly what i said i did not have as much anxiety the second time as i had the first time um the first time i had to have like a water break all kinds of stuff but this time she literally used the rest of the 0.58 syringe and we knocked it out in like 15 minutes um, my lips are super swollen. I feel like I'm just like talking and, and they're just like But um <laughs> It's because she put like most of it on my top lip So I feel like I just caught a reaction or something. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of enjoy it the process so I see why they call it addicting I can't wait for my swelling to go down just so I could see how they naturally gonna look because I'm just excited for that. I'm excited to do my makeup. I'm excited for my lips to just be a little plump and whatnot. So yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next clip. Hey guys, so it has been 10 days since my last appointment and I just wanted to show you guys what my lips look like after they settled in. Um, so yeah, they do look really natural and I like them. I decided not to do a second syringe because after replaying my last clip, I felt like my lips look too big for my face when they were swollen and I'm afraid that if I do another syringe, it's going to look like that. So yeah, I decided to just stay with one syringe and they do look really natural when I'm not wearing anything on them. However, when I do put on lipstick and lip liner, they do look even bigger. So I wanted to show you guys what they look like when I'm not wearing it. And then I have my 
lip liner lipstick and gloss here that i'm gonna apply so that you guys can see what it looks like after so yeah let's jump in so i'm using my kkw lip liner in the nude 2 and i'm just going to line my lips i feel like i hold my breath and risk my life when I'm lining my lips and I'm gonna go in with my KKW Beauty Nude 3 lipstick Now this is a combo that I would normally wear and mind you, doing an ombre effect on the lip also makes it look bigger but for whatever reason I just barely ever do like one color on my lips. So yeah, that's what it looks like with just the lipstick. They do look really big. In my personal opinion, they look pretty big. They look fine. And then I'm going to go in with this Chanel Roche Cocoa Gloss in 722. I feel like when I put the gloss, they look even bigger. So yeah, that is what they look like. I love this combination. It looks good. So yeah. So yeah. This is what it looks like with lip liner, lipstick, and a little bit of gloss. I am obsessed with my lips. I love them. I don't want to go a little bit bigger at all. I feel like when I put my lip liner and everything, they're just fine for my face. I don't want them to look like too big because I do have big eyes and I don't want them to overpower my eyes. I really, really love my eyes. So I always want my eyes to stand out. So yeah, guys, with that, I will be ending this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. If you're thinking of getting lip injections and have any questions or ends up going to Aaron, let me know in the comments down below. Give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I do have some banging videos coming up. I will see you guys next time.